good evening. Welcome, uh, Kloizo. Welcome back to the channel. Here we are. Uh, we've got a war going on, which you can see. Um, the, the Alliance want me to do some hitting, do some killing. Let's have a quick look at what they're up against. Okay, that's interesting. So yellow tank there, purple tank there. Is, is this... Is, that, what colour is that guy? Green? Oh, uncoordinated tanks. Interesting. Interesting. Mwahaha. This changes much. As the weather, I will destroy them. Anyway, um, anyway but I will do it in, in about an hour. Once uh, once I ha can use all 12 attacks in one go, might do a video on it. Who knows? Let's go straight into the, uh, the raid tournament. So we are looking at... Uh, okay... Uh, wrong, 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 wrong choices. But uh, as we found out yesterday, that makes very little odds. Uh, I'm not going to take um, Dougal, although he, he, I like Dougal a lot. He's a healer, um, and that's not going to going to help me out here. Let's just go with this and see where we go. Um, they have got a healer, which is a mistake. They've got a red tank, which is a mistake. It should be one that I can comfortably win. Obviously, it doesn't follow. It will be. See my see the boards yesterday and the general sort of sparsity of season one heroes. In fairness, they've got two season one heroes in their team, which is uh, you know if you look at the leaderboard is is incredibly rare um, for people who are actually winning. Winning, woo! Um, so there we go. Now uh, I'm going to fire blue tiles into Teela. Doesn't really matter because she can't uh, turn them into actual um, what do you call it? Actual healing. So she may as well she can have all the mana she likes. In fact, there is an argument that when it comes to healers, it is worth supplying them with as much mana as you possibly can, as much charge as you possibly can, because that way they will uh, not use their basic attack. And will instead try and attack you with their. Uh, they will use their healing skill, which then does does absolutely nothing. So healers, in fairness, you you actually want to just plug mana into them non-stop. Um, still going to be close, which it's going to be closer than it should be um, by quite a long way. Just can't get right. There we are. Three blue tiles. These should actually finish Dougal off. No, it's not Dougal, is it? It's Magnus. Sorry. Um, he seems to be withstanding an awful lot of damage. A suspiciously large amount of damage, one might say, but there we are. Down he goes. Goodbye. Right, let's move on. Okay, this team's well put together. There's no obvious flaws. Only thing I would say is two reds is probably not the greatest idea when I can take blues. But I'm just going to take him with my blue team and see what happens. Green five in a row. Obviously no use, but maybe... But they've gone for the right idea of having a... Um, hmm, sorry, I'm just pausing for a second. Having purples, two purples is the right idea. Um, I believe Michelle, is it slow? Made slow, I can't remember. Speed, but she's going to be annoying anyway. Uh, let's blow this green grenade and see what happens. Um, I have a feeling this one's going to be one of these where I'm just about going to do them bare minimum. Might manage to kill one hero, but I think I'll lose overall. I'm not liking my chances, frankly. Uh, blue tiles flying all around the place, but just not in the right directions. Make sure I'm going to make sure I kill off at least one Michelle uh, of the Resistance. Listen very carefully. I shall say this only once. Uh, yeah, I didn't expect to win this one. Um, again, could just do. Oh, there we are. Managed to get one more kill in. I might even get. <laughs> Gonna blow this purple grenade and see what happens. Which is a risky strategy. And it's not paid off at all. There we go. Never mind. Boom. Oh, there we are. All over. So that sucked. <sighs> right, on to the next one. Uh, even worse. Uh, the combination of blues and red, especially if my blue team aren't that strong. Uh, the la you know, the bloody battle tournaments, you, you, you I mean I can't it's just a case of trying to do some damage to them uh the game is not being particularly friendly in terms of tiles um the uh, you can hear my frustration in every move as each move successively just piles in more off color tiles that i can't do anything with um 
every single move. <sighs> Rubbish. No, no combos come in at all. I doubt if I'm going to kill a single hero this time round. Um, yep. Rubbish. Awful. Absolutely appalling. Um, right, this team at least have gone... F oh, this team's a rubbish team. Right, this badly put together team. Um, red, a green hero, bad choice. Reds, yeah, uh, yeah, lots of bad choices in this team. Uh, a healer, bad choice. Reds aren't particularly strong against... A so, you know, yeah, really badly put together team. No yellow, uh, sorry, no purple in it at all. Um, yeah, this should be, again, this should be an easy win, but then I've said that several times this tournament and been completely disabu dis disabused of my uh, of my reasonable opinion of the teams I'm facing um, I don't think it's because well it just it just feels like this is it it's like the game saying no no you you can't win no uh, we're going to give you your teams have done well so we're going to give you bad boards until it all goes away anyway that's it I'm feeling grumpy as again as you can probably tell uh, um, let's see if I can get this, should trigger it. Yeah, we are. The combo was enough to kill off them. It's yeah, frustrating. Um, again, it's it's the standard thing of too many overpowered heroes from season two, and yeah, I, I mean you know it's fair enough. I mean play you know the players I fought against. They, you know if they put purple tank in, then they've done the right thing. Uh, they've gone for it. I mean you you can only expect so much. Um, things to go so well it's just very frustrating uh, when you know your only hope is really good boards or at least decent boards and you just get awful awful boards uh this team's really badly put together lotering it um appallingly put together team it's a bloody battle and you've taken a healer you put in the tank of the wrong color you know it's just yeah just really bad uh not mincing my words here today just do better um yeah just i mean i'm guessing you're not somebody who watches my video or you wouldn't actually have made these these kind of mistakes i mean i'm not saying in fairness i'm not saying i've I mean, you know I, there was you know one one tournament recently somebody pointed out i nearly took my unleveled um blunderbuss instead of my leveled blunderbuss which so you know mistakes do happen but uh yeah uh, I, that to me that was just a poor poor choice and there we are two losses uh top 25 percent uh, defenses e oh that's brutal so my defenses are not doing very well at all um yeah there we go but then you're seeing more and more of finding in the three star tournaments it's just dominated by people who have got uh um what's his name um i want to say rumple silk skin it's not rumple skill skin um the uh christmas guy Eh, it's not great, Simon. Let's just see if I get if I get three star this time. I risk of bigger. Mm. Got to say no then. Two two stars. That's not enough. Right. Uh, yeah. The uh, pumpernickel. Pumpernickel. That's what I'm thinking of. See him all over the place. The fact that he even comes up sometimes on five star raid tournaments just just says all you need to know, really. Uh, peacekeeping operations going on, obviously. So you know, try and fill those in. Oh, I'm probably not going to manage the war. The built for war weapons event. It's just been too busy. So there we go. Anyway, there we are. So hope everybody's well. Do take care of yourself. Please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe. And as ever, it just remains for me to say goodbye. Hoyle Vower, thank you for watching. And may death come swiftly to your enemies. Goodbye.